Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. It has been a while since I've actually talked to you. I got another product review and I finally got the time today to do it after all the fiasco with me getting ready for my next term coming up, which is fall term and it starts next Monday anyway. But I have another product review for you and it's going to be on this stuff here. This is the Buddy Scrub and this is the event advanced activated charcoal flavor this actually comes in five flavors according to what I discovered um, you can find it for starters before I even state the five flavors you can find this at the only place I know where you can find it is over at select urban outfitters stores and if you find it there it runs at about eighteen dollars plus tax you might be able to check on Urban Outfitters online or even on their app because I think they have an app too. But you can also find it, if you don't find it there, you can find it on the Buddy Scrub website. This entire company is actually in Australia. So if you want to head to their website there and just order from there, I'll put the link of the um, website in the description. I'll put the website in the description below and you can check it out from there. But on the website, this one actually, this particular one actually runs at about $15.95 the prices vary depending on the types of flavors over there there are about five flavors this is one of them this is the activated charcoal one and this was the only flavor that they had in um, Urban Outfitters the other four are the coffee one the raw cocoa one the bamboo one and the green tea one I'm really looking to try the green tea one next but I'll get to that very soon but simply put, there's not much of a story behind me wanting to try this mask, mask, body scrub out. I'm all over the place right now. But there's not much of a story for me wanting to try this stuff out. After I got done with the Tree Hut Shea Sugar Scrub, I was looking more for a body scrub that would work well not just for my body but for my face. And plus I wanted more natural ingredients because you know I am a natural organic fanatic. Not in terms of eating not much of a health nut but you get the idea here I just like using products that are good for your body so after I walked around Urban Outfitters I discovered this and I saved up enough money to get myself a little baggie of this and I also discovered the entire um, company on Instagram because now I'm on Instagram since everybody seems to be on there nowadays but long story short I picked it up and I gave it a few tries just so I can make this review as accurate for you as possible here. For starters, oh and just to let you know, it gives you the labels right over here. It is vegan, so if you are vegan or a vegetarian, feel free to try this out. This might grab your attention. I actually like the way that they, um, you know, advertise this. It's actually kind of funny. He keep, It's almost like it's a guy talking to you, if that makes any sense to you. I say just find a packet and read the back of it because I really do like the way that they advertise this stuff. It's not your average body scrub, so that's probably why. But simply put, this scrub is worth the money, okay? I mean, at $18, it is very expensive, somewhat expensive, but you get what you paid for. And the best part about this scrub is it cannot be on. It doesn't just have to be used for your body. You can also use it for your face, which is what I've been mostly using this stuff for since it has activated charcoal in it. But this stuff right here is worth the money. Um, for starters, since this is activated charcoal, it comes in like a black scrub. I don't even know if you guys can see it or pick it up. But the scrub is mostly made of sea salt and glucose which is and sucrose which is sugar basically sugar so the thing about this is when I use it in the shower and by the way you use it for a shower or a bath what I like to do when I use this scrub I don't like to scoop it out with my hands because when I'm in the shower almost everything around me is getting wet aside from myself besides myself of course so what I like to do is I like to get a little plastic spoon of sorts or a little plastic spatula and just scoop some of the um, scrub out depending on how much I want to use and actually on that note you do not need a lot for certain places on your body a little goes a long way and the only way that I can think of that you would go through packets of these really fast is if every time you used it you use a whole bunch of it for your entire body from head to toe for this I don't do that so because of me only using a little bit of this a little goes a long way for me and 
frankly it works very very well especially on my face I'm this is a really good beauty treatment for my face it's like an extremely cheap spa treatment well I wouldn't say cheap it's like $18 but still you get the idea but I usually scoop it out with a little plastic spoon. I don't like sticking my wet hands or fingers into there because I don't want to get any water in it. And it even tells you on the back that you can't get water in this stuff. Otherwise, you'll ruin it. But after I do that, I usually massage the scrub on my underarms, my belly, my abdomen area, my belly. Sometimes my bikini area, you know, just to get that smooth. And on rare occasions, my arms and legs. The thing is, I feel like I don't really need to exfoliate my arms and legs very well because they're already toned and whatnot and they don't experience a lot of dry, rough skin there. It's my underarms and my face that have the most problems here. And I find that every time that I use this, by the way, it tells you to use it twice a week to experience the best results. And that's what I've been doing. But every time that I use this scrub, guys, my body is left not very very soft not dried out it just feels so smooth like really really smooth no bumps cracks nothing it's almost like the dry skin didn't even exist it works even better for my face and considering that i have oily skin and activated charcoal works the best in my opinion for oily skin this stuff ow well that kind of hurt this stuff here leaves my skin my face very smooth to the touch to the point where I can apply my DIY facial moisturizer to my face with no hassle whatsoever before when I didn't have this I would just use regular soap and that could be I don't know let's say Apple Valley natural soap or even Dr. Bronner's soap which is what I'm using right now and my face would be really dry and on top of that because it was dry I would have a hard time putting my facial serum on there not with this stuff what I do is I first cleanse my face using the soap bar that I'm using right now which is Dr. Bronner's and then I go ahead and massage a little bit of this scrub on all areas of my face now sometimes this scrub can be somewhat abrasive so if you have somewhat delicate skin what I recommend for you to do is add a little bit of water to the little bit of scrub that's in your hand and it'll kind of soften up the scrub a bit so it's not so abrasive or rough on your skin. This is pretty much what I do every time I massage the scrub onto my face. I add a little bit of water. First I just, you know, massage it in a circular motion on my face and then I take a little bit of water, soften it up a bit and make sure I get it into certain areas here. And then once I do that, I leave it on for the duration of the shower so I can get the activated charcoal to really, really, you know, do its job like that. And then by the end of my shower, I just rinse it off my face. Now, sometimes I will treat my neck and my decollete area, but mostly I treat my face. And every single time, I promise you, every single time, this stuff leaves my face so smooth and soft. And actually, it's making my face look a lot better. I don't know if the camera is actually picking this up, but I feel like my face has worked a lot better. Oh, and I forgot to mention to you, if you have stretch marks, this is also a good product for that too. Because I have actually have, I actually have stretch marks on my hips because of, um, I don't actually know when the stretch marks appeared. Yeah, I don't know. But... I actually have stretch marks on my hips and I've been using this stuff on my hips and on the, where the stretch marks are and they're less noticeable. It even says, I think it even says if you check out their websites, it's really, really good. Their scrubs are good for stretch marks and whatnot. But there's not much more that I want to say about this scrub. You'll have to try it for yourself and remember it comes in five different versions or flavors as I like to call them. There's this one which is the charcoal one, there's the coffee one, the bamboo one, the green tea one, and the cocoa one. Many people happen to like the um, the coffee one and the cocoa one. I'm guessing those two are pretty popular but if I had to guess between the two which is the most popular I would probably say the coffee one because well, if you're a coffee drinker or if you like the smell of coffee, that would be the one you'd probably gravitate to. But in the future, I will definitely fork over the money to try this again. I still got some left, by the way. I'm like probably right here. 
because I've only been using a little bit at a time but I will definitely purchase this scrub again in the future I'm really hoping I can try the green tea version because people have been raving about that too and actually I'm gonna have to look up the benefits of green tea for your skin because I don't remember what they are but I really do want to try that one but that's pretty much all I have to say about this scrub. Five out of five stars. You gotta try it. It's awesome. If you're a vegan or a vegetarian, or even if you're not that, and you're like me, who just likes to use vegan products, vegan beauty products and whatnot, or clean beauty products, this is the product you would go for. I mean, it's two in one. You don't need a separate scrub for your face or your body. This is perfect for both places, okay? So, like I said at the beginning of the video, I will leave the information in the description below. If you've actually had the chance to try this stuff, let me know in the comments below. If you have any questions about this stuff, how you should use it, how many times should you use it, is it good for whatever kind of skin, put them in the comments below and I'll try to answer them to the best of my ability. And by the way, the last time that I was on their Instagram profile for Buddy Scrub, I heard that there was supposed to be a giveaway where they're giving away all five of the body scrubs over there. Now, I think you'll probably see that if you actually go to the website. It should be the first thing you see, but you can enter in, I don't know if you can enter in once because I already did that, or if you can enter in several times in order to win it. And I don't remember when this giveaway ends, but the prize is that they're going to give you a bundle of all five scrubs to you if you win. So if you're interested in that, go ahead and enter the giveaway. It should be the first thing that you see on the website, which I said I'll put in the description below. But if you like this review, a thumbs up is always appreciated. And feel free to share it, whether it be on Instagram, Twitter, uh, Snapchat. Well, I don't know about Snapchat. I don't use Snapchat, so please don't judge me, okay? I've never used Snapchat before. But feel free to share this review if you really, really like it. I am still trying to pump out the reviews as much as I can here. I've just been really busy trying to prepare for my next semester here. And basically, I'm just trying to sort everything out here. So stay patient with me i appreciate your support and welcome to any new subscribers that come to my channel here and i will see you guys in the next review okay see you later guys bye bye